So, you want to believe that Jigglypuff is feeble? I'll show you that he's, she is exactly that. Feeble. Wait a minute. Ah, that's what I want. Ah! Whatever. I'm Mr. Game & Watch, so it doesn't really matter. Anyway, welcome back, everybody, to more of the Super Smash Bros. Brawl events. This is your host, MJ406, and I'm hoping this is the finale as I take on... Wow, this is terrible. Oh, good lord. Yeah, this is the worst. These little boys are huge, and they're trying to kill me. Thankfully, this is easy, so hopefully I won't have to deal with their shit. <gasps> oh! Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! Time for Jigglypuff to reign supreme, then. See, now that you got this far, you're able to kick their ass. Get to the first, get to the first area, and you can fight them on their on normal terms. I doubt I'll get that far, so I guess I'll mention it now. If you wait to get to the third area, Jigglypuff would be strong as shit. It might have been just her, I don't remember. But we almost got there. Too bad I didn't want that to go on for too long. Oh boy! Oh, they're working together! Yeah! Sonic and Mario! After Jigglypuff's great comeback, my bad. No problem. It's none at all. Only race can decide true victors. Why are we racing, Sonic? Why? Ass. Of course I'm going to be a freaking Mario. Why would I want to be goddamn Sonic for this? Ready, go! Besides, we're battling, not racing, you freaking moron. Mario's a much better than Sonic. Haven't you seen his history? Sonic's history is garbage! Ho ho! Fuck your garbage, bitch! I won't let you live. Wow, we only killed two of them so far? Okay, that's three. Your event is fucking garbage! I'm not gonna let you live now! Go fuck yourself! Oh! Oh no! Oh! Shit! I can't let you live! Come on, Mario, what are you doing? You gotta go fast! I've been trying to go fast! Can't you see that shit? You're not going fast enough! Let me show you how it's done! Ho oh, ho! Gotta go fast! Oh shit, gotta go fast! Help me! Thanks for saving my ass after so long! You know I got your back, man! Ho ho! Hey bro, we gotta train with the Olympics! I am not playing that shit with you again! You're already in for the next couple seasons of the Olympics! Son of a bitch! I'm fucking out of here! Ugh. Again, why do I do this? The new weapon of Shadow Moses. Ooh! The robotic weapons have been rolled out! Only one of them is an ally! That would be my robot! Ugh, that didn't sound right. Oh god! Okay, this one could be a little challenging, actually. They both have two lives, we both have one! So they really wanted to save the third party for towards the end of this, huh? Nice to know it was an ally. Go ahead and hide! If you're down there, you're less likely to get killed. Aha! I'll protect your ass, Rob. Don't worry about it. Yeah, it's right. Take him down. Aha! Ow! Don't worry, Rob! I'll save your ass! Woo! Yeah, I'll see you later. Leaving now! Oh boy, the Shadow of Andros! Oh no, Andros! It's a fierce attack by Andros and Wolf. What?! Take them, Team Star Fox! 
Of course, General. Andros won't have his way with me. So it's time for me to be Fax. Star Fax. Let's do this. So you have to beat Wolf while surviving the fight against Andros. Again, if one of you survives, you're fine, but keep your guard up. Andros will never leave. So, good luck to you. Falco, survive! Oh, man. No! Falco! I shall avenge you! Like that! Wow! Easier said than done! <laughs> Actually, easier done than said. The final battle for two! A fierce battle of nasty rivals. You can't lose now! That's right, a whole bunch of rivals or main enemies from the games have shown up to fight you, and you can be whoever you want with both characters! So you can both tag team with whoever you want. This always seems fitting. I may as well be both of the Mario Brothers since they were never together for some reason. What the hell? Oh, wow. You actually see Luigi's difference in jump. That's pretty cool. Hopefully I won't need Luigi, but I'll have him at the ready. I could have been two Marios, but that would have been lame and too easy. Fuck you. Back off. Thankfully, they both have two lives, though, so this is actually pretty easy. I almost saved his ass from getting whooped. Come on. Ow, fuck. Shit! Had another conversation. Ah! Didn't know what tickets you wanted to pop. I thought we got! Okay, okay. Now fool around. Oh, Luigi! Ah, saved your ass. Oh god. I won't let them beat us. I'll attack us both in their onslaught. Ow. God, fuck this. Fuck off. Oh god, it's really hard to survive with both of them. Fuck you. I'll find a way to get this to work. Damn, this is actually harder than I was expecting it to be. Ah, fuck! Oh, Luigi, you almost had it, man. Don't worry about it. Let's just beat him up for now, man. All right. Oh, cool, another one. Oh! Ah, oh, what? How was that? Ah, oh, fuck. Sorry, Luigi, you're gonna have to tank it, bud. Take one for the team. Oh! Rack team. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh! Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah! Ah, oh, damn it. The conversation distracted me. Oh, God damn it! Oh, the true all-star battle is the final event, and it sucks balls. Fight everyone without any breaks. It's endless, but a suitable final battle. So those that know Smash well enough since Melee, there's been a mode called all-star mode where you fight everybody in a series of battles, every main character in the game. This one, you fight all of them at the same fucking top. Well, you fight all of them in one straight-on battle. I'll do the technique that I've heard works for this. We'll have to fucking go crazy with this shit. So, if you want to beat this by yourself, the way to do it is to do this. Have two Meta Knights. Now let's have some fun. Watch them struggle as they try to get involved. I just have to keep track of which is player one, which is player two. It's unfortunate I have them on reverse sides. Oh, 
Oh no! However, these guys are super lightweight, so all you have to do is just kill them. However, easier said than done. I mean, there are workarounds, but you know. We're not making this any easier on ourselves because we keep going out of place. Rather, I keep going out of place. There we go. Yeah, come on. Get in the fray, Yoshi. Get in the fray. Yeah, here we go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's getting nice and souffléed. Souffléed. I'm making this hard, though. And notice you both only have one life. That's part of what makes this a freaking challenge. Yeah, there we go. This would look like the fiercest sword fight ever if we were actually fighting each other. Alright, go over there. I'll go over here and... Sword fight! Ha, ha, yeah, you can't kill me. Yeah, I'll show you what for. You can't beat me. I'm a juggernaut, bitch. Yeah, that's right. You can't fight shit. Fuck off. We didn't want you to get involved. This is our fight. You get involved, we'll fucking kill you. We'll fucking kill you. Oh, yeah, that's right, bitch. We'll fucking murder you. We'll murder you senselessly. Come on, come on. Get involved. I fucking dare you. There you go. Good boy. And now... We fight to the death! You all just keep walking in on us. You know better by now. This ought to work. I think I have my new method. The method was to frickin' trap them in there, and then, yeah. You trap them in there, and then you just... You just end up freaking killing them afterwards. I think that's the method for hard mode. Again, better two people. As long as I have him doing that, I can actually move myself around and do what I want. And... Final Smash time for that. However, keep note that your Final Smash can actually hurt your partner, too, with Meta Knight. Just do what you've been doing, buddy. We can get through this. We'll find a way. Yeah, there we go. Don't worry. I'll keep making it so they can't kill us. Oh, what the fuck? What an asshole. Why would he hit that with a nine hammer? Dick. And if you don't notice, they fight, make you fight the characters in order. From original Smash to Melee to Brawl. Starting with the main eight from Smash, the original Smash, their unlockable characters. Then the main original characters from Melee, their unlockable characters. And then, uh... The main fires bail one brawl, and then they're unlock the characters. So yeah, there you go. If you're wondering how the order is decided, I just told you. See, this can be kind of hard. But thank I'm doing it on easy, and I'm figuring out a better method than what I was like looked at. Perhaps the method I saw was better with two people. You still do it with one, but it's better to do it with two. At least it's nice to know that you can beat all the events with just one person. But since it's on easy, I don't need to worry about freaking shielding, so... I don't need to worry about not being able to reach the LNR buttons with my current controller setup. If you're wondering how I'm doing this right now, my left hand has Mennonite on the A button. The player 2 Mennonite on the A button. With my pinky near the control stick in case I need to move him. While my right hand is doing my pinky around the A button, and I'm gonna be doing everything else with the other fingers.
You're fat. You're not gonna get by us. Oh, fuck! And now it gets hard, because there's only one of me. I could probably still win, but it'll be harder, that's for sure. It didn't help that I freaking nailed my partner with this thing really badly. What power? Weird that move doesn't do a lot of freaking launching power. Basically, you just want to damage them enough so you can launch them quickly with a either a good up smash or a good up a strong up attack. All right. As long as you can angle them into a nice string of attacks, you can probably take it down. Even with one person. Of course, if you're really good at the game, you probably don't even need to do the Meta Knight tactic. You probably just fight with whoever your best character is, and then just wipe the floor of them. I'll give you good props, though, if you can beat this on hard. Whether it's one person or two, if you can do it on hard, bravo. If it's even one person, you deserve all kinds of praise. Now die! He'll die soon enough. Time to kill you! Victory! Even if it was on easy, I don't care. I cleared him, so I'm happy. Well, I didn't even let the fanfare go out. I'm an asshole. Woo! I did it! That's all the events, baby! Yeah! Hmm. Wow, I had, I had extra time after the last event last time, too. So now what? Um, uh, is there anything interesting to show off? Not really. There's a boss battle mode, there's bosses, there's more multi-man stuff. But you have to get a lot of kills in this. Ah, eh, may as well show that off, then. Choose your character. So, you need to get a good number of kills in uh, Cruel Brawl in order to unlock stuff. What better way to do it? And with Kit. You wanna know why? These guys are greedy to kill you. So, the best way to deal with this... Ready, go. RUN AWAY! Just freaking get them to come after you. And then fly to the other side of the stage. Hang around for a while. They may think you're gonna fall and they'll chase you down. After a while, well... See, they'll all jump after you. If you're smart, or they're stupid. You'll get them to jump down like that. If their mayor jump doesn't get them back up, well, you got them killed. It's best with Pit, though. You can also do this Jigglypuff, but because of Pit's up B in this game. Oh, yeah, don't press up to get back up on the ledge because they will punch you. You just want to press back or down. You just want to drive them off as they come after you. Only the green doesn't get affected by this. It's a Kirby model. Red is Captain Falcon. Blue is once again Zelda. And yellow is Mario. Weird. They give you a Captain Falcon model, even though he's a locked character in this game. See, look. I already have seven. You don't even have to do any damage to him. You just have to get him to chase you down. Of course, it gets harder as... More of the Kirby models show up, but... Well, do it right, you won't have to worry about it. Again, don't press up to get back up to the ledge. Just press away from the ledge, either down or across. Come on. Come on. I'm primed for eating here, you know. You don't want to stay too close to the ledge, though, or they won't go after you. Did that green one really just kill itself? How? But careful, they're still strong as shit. Oh, I got I almost had 10 again. But yeah, that's how you do it. Pretty cool, huh? Pretty simple. And there's not really much else to show. Home run contest stuff is about the same. Target smash or stages now for particular levels instead of actual character stages. Training's the same. Retro mode is long, um, trophies are there, stickers are there, blah, blah, blah. Well, 
I may as well end this the way I ended the one before. Let's try this one more time. Can I do it like a man? Probably not, but it's worth trying. Success or failure, we'll end this. Just like with Melee, I'm going to end this on the final event and try to end it like a real man. All right, Mario, you better beat this shit up right. I better use my name to give myself good luck. My MJ name will not be put down. So yeah, you've seen the best way to do this. On hard, you want to freaking have Martha or Ike out so they can counter the hell out of Mario so he can get his ass whooped. You can try to bait him to freaking kill himself, but that's easier said than done because he doesn't always take the bait. Being a really good player and doing this is, well, you have to be really good. You definitely want to take out Mario first because he's by far the biggest threat. Snake and... Ow. Snake and Sonic are not problems, but Mario is because he is relentless. Any character, low tier or high tier, can be powerful if you know how to use him right. And this event shows his strength tenfold. Oh, God. Ow! Yeah, I figured I wasn't going to win that. Yo, let's try to be with Marth one more time. You wonder why? Because I feel like it. I got to have my boy Marth try to win this real on hard. I feel like I won't, I won't feel like it's a true success unless I win this on hard for real. Fuck off! Fuck off! Oh! Wrecked! Wrecked! Oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> oh, stickers, stickers, stickers! Stickers, stickers, stickers! Ow, shouldn't have gone for that. Oh, you did the water move, you bastard! Come on! Take the bait! Oh, damn it, he took the bait, but I didn't prepare for the bait. Oh, come on, get rid of that fucking flyer. Flyer? Fire flower! Mm. Yes! Thanks for pushing him off, asshole! Yes! This match is mine! All because of that beautiful counter I did towards the beginning. See? Counter Mario, you can wipe him out. And hopefully his over-reliance on items will deal him in. Ah, fuck you. Of course, I'm relying on items only because I feel like I should be. Or fight like this. See, look, they're so stupid. The over reliance on items fucking gets them killed. Now you die! Oh, yeah. Ow! I should have been prepared for that. I'm gonna beat it on hard, though! I'm gonna beat it on hard! I can't let this chance slip up! I may have failed the ending of Melee, but I'm not gonna fail the end of this, you hear me? Ah, fuck. Mm. Now you'll see what it's like to fight somebody who's a giant! Giant firecrackers, bitch! You're dead! You're dead. Oops. Ha ha ha! You ain't putting me to sleep. Oh my god, that was way too relentless. Yeah, that was even a new record, baby. Yeah, there we go. That's success in a hat right there. Success in a hat? I think I meant to say success in a half. Wow. Wow. Good work there, Jethro. Well, whatever. We did it. The events are over. However, I'm going to have one little bonus part for you. It'll be a lot. Actually, not little. It's going to be long. You'll see, though. Come back next time, and I'll have one last little thing to show you. It's not an event, but a little something I just want to leave you with. Just, you know, Nintendo advertisement, because I'm a dick.